um, they had an ex exhibition on the Friday before I left, and we went there and we meet at least 10 million students. They are very happy, and they are satisfied the way Taiwan is being run. They said a very safe country, they can wrap midnight, 3 a.m., and nobody interfered with them. So they are very happy studying in Taiwan. Did you have any discussion with these students as it relates to uh, not staying in Taiwan? Because I know that was one of the uh, uh, points that was brought up by the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, you know, that, you know, our best and brightest are not coming home. Well, I think that is what is catching us as a country. And so I think the, 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 when, the, when the scholarship has been issued, there have been the most stringent measures that they can at least come back home for two years. But because when they go there, it's a free country. They feel very comfortable in Taiwan. So most of them are probably, they are staying. While we were a small third world country, um, you have seen how this country has been advanced into technology, into everything. And somehow you have to ask, the, ask ourselves the question, what will be the future for our country if you want to advance likewise? Because um, as these young people go out, they want to come back and implement what they have learned. But if, they, if it's not available in Belize, they will stay in Taiwan.